morning, everyone. So how many of us are not excited that summer is gone? Uh, I know that uh, just because we're vegan doesn't mean that we don't get a chance to barbecue outside. Uh, I used to love putting either seitan on the grill, shish kebabs, uh, or just load it up with vegetables. So uh, with winter coming around, uh, some of us just don't like standing outside with the barbecue. I know some of them do. Uh, I know my husband once in a while he'll get his kick and he'll go stand in the cold but I'm not so much for the cold so I'm excited to show you something. I prefer barbecuing in a warmer climate but thanks to Starfruit look what she sent me. Claire you're a doll I don't know how to thank you. She wants me to review her rock smokeless grill guys Look what it has. It has a place where you can actually keep your vegetables warm on both sides. This is a place where we're going to grill and it has holes where the drippings fall in. But it, all, it also has a little spot where you add water so this way whatever fat falls into, um, into the grill will not create any smoke in your house. So. I am going to show you how this works. I'm going to open it up for the first time. I do have some veggies already ready for me. Unfortunately, I didn't have any seitan ready. So we're not going to be grilling any seitan. But we will grill some vegetables. Here we go. I'm excited to try this out. Oh, upside down. I had it up upside down, so let me see if I can flip this over. So you know I haven't tried this before, so we're going to see how this works. I'm excited. This is going to be fun because I hate standing out in the cold. That is one thing that I do not enjoy. My husband didn't mind once in a while, but it was only once in a while. He wouldn't do it that often, trust me. But being that I love my grilled vegetables, huh? we're going to try this baby out. Let's see, what do we have? We have a booklet, and a little bit of styrofoam. How do we open? Oh, here we go. Here's our, it's got an adjustable dial and plug. It has our grill pan, which I'm going to remove from... And it's the rock. You know what that means? That means nothing sticks on it. That means that your food is going to slide right through. So, okay, we're going to put our beautiful tray in. And that's where we're going to end up putting water. And this goes in. There's a little place right here where you put in the plug end. So, I guess that would go in first. And then we're going to... There, that's simple. Wow, this is really simple. And here is our plug. Okay, so plug goes in this way. Okay, so plug is a prong and it's got two holes. And it has a dial where you can adjust. And a marking where that's off. And then you could adjust your temperature. Pretty cool. Okay, so we're going to plug her in and plug her into my outlet. I'm excited. And it uses very little heat, I mean energy, which is good. So if I want to grill something, I don't have to use my oven all the time. Because like I said, I am not going to stand out in the cold. That's not something that I could endure. Okay, so we're going to turn it on. I'm not sure if you can see it, guys. Warm, 200, 300. So I'm going to blast her up because I like my vegetables grilled quickly, but not, not so soggy. So I'm going to put her up on high heat. Oh, wow, and it heats up really fast, too. Okay, this is great. So I'm going to add some water into that part. Let me turn it around. I like it like easier. So we have her on high. So I'm gonna, oop, yeah, this gets hot really, really fast. Now this is, okay, this section here and this section here is warmer than 
this section right there. Okay, this is good. So we are going to add some water. And hopefully, I could have had all of this set up before before I started this video, but I wanted to show you that this is my first time trying it, so I can give a really good review. And again, thank you, Claire, for thinking about me. And wow, this is nice and hot. And here are my beautiful veggies. They're already prepared. So I'm going to start off with my beautiful asparagus. Try not to burn my hands either. And we've got some oyster mushrooms. And we have a hot pepper. We've got some zucchini slices. And we're going to see where this takes us. Maybe I'll put some here. These are very delicate. So I'm going to put the mushrooms right on the edge. There we go. Yeah, let's put this here for now. There we go. I have it nice and high. And as I can see, there's hardly, hardly any smoke whatsoever. This is crazy. I remember one time I had a grill and um, the amount of smoke it made, it was like it would just fumigate my kitchen. But as you can see, there's hardly, hardly any, any, any smoke whatsoever. And the rock makes one of the best products. This is going to last forever. If you take care of these uh, pans and the grill... This will last forever. And guess what, guys? One of you is going to win this grill. So you know how you know what you got to do to win this grill, right? You have to uh, comment below in my video. You have to uh, share with your friends if you want your name in uh, for a second time. That means if you share it on Facebook, you got to come back and give me another link. That means you got to have your name in there twice. First time is your comment. And then you have to have uh, the link where uh, you posted the video. So this way you get your name twice. And don't forget to like this video. So I got to say thank you to Starfrit. And I love you guys. And this is why I do these uh, reviews. When they ask me to do a review, I always make sure there's something there for my subscribers. So... I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. And I hope you're going to enjoy this as much as I'm enjoying it right now. Let's see what's happening here. Look at that. Drill marks and all. This is crazy. Beautiful. And if you find that it's too high, just lower your heat, guys. Look at that smokeless grill. Do you see how there's hardly any smoke? I'm very impressed. Beautiful, beautiful. And we're cooking our mushrooms slowly, and then we're going to place those on the grill too. There we go. Where they could get some beautiful grill marks. One of you is going to get to win this. I told you I was going to have some pretty cool giveaways. And this is only one of many to come. I have more coming. And I am excited to share this with all of you. Look at that. Beautiful, 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 beautiful vegan food. Like, who needs meat when you have this, right?
and check your water level. If you see that it's starting to smoke up a little, all you have to do is just add a little extra uh, water to the bottom. And that should take care of the smoke. But yeah, you hardly get any smoke whatsoever. This is really, really impressive. I am impressed. So there you go guys, a new giveaway for you. So remember, you got to be a subscriber of mine and you have to be able, uh, you have to uh, leave a comment below. You know what, let's make this fun and tell me why you want to change to a vegan diet or why you became vegan. And this way I get to know you a little more. And uh, don't forget, if you want your name in, for a double chance, you have to be able to share it with someone. If you're sharing it on Facebook or Twitter uh, or even Instagram, come back and let me know where the link is and then your name is going to be put in twice. So how cool is this? There's hardly, hardly any smoke. I'm cooking this in my kitchen and I hardly have any smoke whatsoever. This is really impressive. And these are pretty much done, except for the pepper. I will cook that a little longer. So there you go, guys. So I'm going to say good luck to you. Don't forget, if you're not a subscriber yet, subscribe. If you hit that little bell, you'll get notifications when I put up new videos. And there's going to be a lot more giveaway, guys, and a lot more delicious recipes for all of you to try. And... If you haven't gone vegan, I'm going to say go ahead and do it because it's the best thing that you can do for yourself, for especially the animals, for your children, the planet, your health. It is the best thing you can do for that. So I'm going to say thank you again for being part of my, my YouTube channel. Thank you for following me on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook. I just want to thank you because I love you guys. And this is my way to say thank you by making sure that one of you is going to always get a chance to win something when I do a giveaway. So, good luck to all of you. And guess what, guys? I'm going to see you in my next video. For more videos like this, make sure to subscribe to Connie's Rawsome Kitchen. Give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends.